same, but I'm telling you, I've changed. This is a brand new me. This is the me that resided in me that's decided to be and is now demanding expression. This is the me that's required to be, that's inspired, you see, and now, before my confession, this is a new me, so excuse me while I read the warranty and the clause. Here, it says here quite clearly that this here, the new me, is complete whole and without any flaw. The old me would scold me, many times old me told me that I wasn't good enough to do shit. The best thing about the new me is that I now know that the old me was talking a load of it. And you know what's more? All that shit I've done before, I've been absolved, the universe isn't keeping score. This is a new me, no longer unruly when things don't go my way or people don't do as I say. That was the old me and you could not console me if I would fly into a rage, but it's okay. Old me's not around anymore. I've gotten locked up in a cage. <laughs> this is a new me, no more excuses based on my upbringing and my history. I've become a bit of a sage. I've turned a new page and I'm writing a brand new story. This is a new me, now to express what I think, I transform paper with ink and I save all my rent and my rage for the stage. The new me knows that there's nothing wrong with me that what's right with me can't fix. I'll give you that for free. I got that from my therapist, a solution-focused therapy tip. Mm -hmm. Now, how to get the best of this new me? It's best not to pick a fight with me. I said the old me was out of control before. We don't want to invite an encore. Shine a light on what's right with me if you want to stay tight with me. Anyway, this is a new me. There's nothing you can do me. You can even boo me. I love you. Fucking sue me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The new me is still me. You feel me? I'm just acting with a little bit more responsibility. Oh, you're going to become so fond of my newfound ability to respond. See, I'm taking life a bit more seriously, even though I'm still quite boyful. But every day, the new me writes down 10 reasons to feel joyful. Because the new me knows that all that matters is that I feel good. And this is something that the old me never properly understood. So I'm standing up more straight. I'm breathing more deeply. I fucking meditate. <laughs> and it's like being connected to another state. I don't know, call it my essence, my spirit, my zing. All I know is that my bling is within. And my heart no longer feels so tight and gloomy. It feels more like a roomy. Oh, this new me so bright and bloomy. The old me was so criticising, but this new me, whoa, I've got that Kundalini rising, and this is just the beginning. Because while those chakra wheels are spinning, most times I get win-win situations with all my fellow beings. Um, do you like this new me? Yeah. 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 Um, yeah. Do you want to do me? <laughs> yeah. Listen, I don't blame you. I would do two if I could do myself, which is really ironic because I told the old me to go and fuck himself. <laughs> I said, if your cow won't go, I mean, if your old you won't do, then you've got to be like me and find yourself a brand new you. You feel like you've got a seat on the front row pew, a room with a view. I said, before when you saw me, that was an old me. But shall I tell you something truly? I was always a new me. You just never knew me. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah.